Well, hello there, folks, and welcome to another episode of Myers Corner. Today, we are going to unbox a new line of series that we have not unboxed from Loot Crate before. This is the Fallout Crate from Loot Crate. Loot Crate, Crate, Fallout Crate. Yes, the Fallout Crate from Loot Crate. Fallout Crate, you see there? Yes, it is. Licensed by Bethesda. So let's take a look inside, shall we? So, in this little nice box, we have, we have. First of all, let us, let us, as this is the first time you're looking at these boxes from Fallout, let's just take a look at the box itself. It has the typical blue color from blue from uh, Fallout. It has the, the wall boy and the original text there. It does say, uh, it does say Loot Gaming Bethesda on the side and Loot Gaming on the other side. That's about it. Of course, we have these little things. I like the blue color and the one with the pit boy, no, the, the vault boy. The pit boy is something else. The pit boy is actually this one. This is the pit boy. One of the, I would say, first editions of the pit boy. But uh, that's actually not what we came for, isn't it? So. Let's look at this at another time. This is the Vault Boy. And actually that was spelled Pip Boy, not Pit Boy. So yeah, um, Vault Boy. Let's take a look inside. So we do see we have a box. We have something stripes and something that appears to be a t-shirt. Shall we take a look at the t-shirt? It has a nice green color. It does say Fallout Crate Bethesda. It's a 2X, very nice green color. And uh, what have we got? What do we got? Let's take a look. It looks like, it looks like the mysterious stranger. He appears out of nowhere and helps out and suddenly and then suddenly he disappears again. So, with some specific perks, actually more or less the stranger perk, you'll be able to call or get the mysterious stranger to, dis to appear in a fight scene, help you out and vanish. Like he was never there. Never know what hit them, the enemy that is. So, what else do we have? We have these stripes. It looks like a pair of socks, actually. Exclusive loot wear socks. So let's take a closer look at these socks. Socks. That sucks. So these socks, it looks like socks from the Enclave. So 2020 Enclave with the nice enclave socks more or less let's take a take a look how it would something something like this maybe nice socks actually and the inside it looks pretty pretty decent pretty decent so a pair of enclave socks of course all in the universe of out. Let's take a look at the next item. That would be this, whatever that is. What does it say? It will say screenshots. Screenshots. I don't know what is this. Screenshots. 
Oh yeah, yeah, I know, I know. That's part of a uh, collectible set. If I have, if I have all six crates, I will have a figurine at the end. In this uh, particular, and this is the beginning of a set. So when we're done, we have a complete figurine, and we start out. With the head and the tail. You see what it is? It is very nice. I think it's going to be a very tall figurine actually. Isn't it? Very nice. Very nice, very nice figurine head. So I can't wait to to see the next parts and begin to build the puzzle together to get the, a more complete set. But that is the first part of the set and the first crate that we uh, are going to unbox from Fallout. The next part is one of these nice Fallout crate collectible figurines that Loot Crate has uh, made. We do. Uh, in the past, get a, a similar one, not a similar, but, a, but one of these collectibles. And the one we got back in the days, in one of the other crates, was this uh, power armor dude. Similar to the set that we are going to now collect more parts from. So this one, it's going to be, let's see. Do, 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 do. I've got the similar. Let's see how this is. I've got a similar stand as the other one. And we place it right on there. I hope, I hope, I just have to place it correctly, I hope we don't, we're not going to break anything. This is an iBot, an iBot from Fallout. You see them around in the wasteland, spinning around, playing music more or less, and they also will attack you, especially if you are if you attack them first. They normally just spin around in the wasteland, minding their own business, playing music, whatever. But uh, that's an iBot. The second part of a collection of these. So, and also by subscribing on these boxes now, I can't wait to get more of these collectibles. So the next part is, this is, this looks like, this is a stalking Mothman window thingy thing, so something to put on the window. I'm not going to put this on any windows, it's going to be collecting dust over here in the corner with all the other ones I have. That's another thing. Then we have what appears to be a very nice pin, actually. Uh, unfortunately, we haven't been around loot crates, uh, fallout crates before, so this is pin number 19. But it's still, we're going to collect them from now on. And so far we, we are able to. Looks very nice, this pin. It's the watch. Doesn't say, it does say watch. Very nice pin, very nice collectible. And a very nice beginning of a set to collect. Collect them all. And I believe that was it in the crate from the, from the Fallout crate, from the new crate. 
we have this uh, QR code of course but uh, that's another story that I don't like <laughs> yeah I think that was about it folks I hope you enjoyed this little episode of the unboxing from a fallout plate from Ukraine. I'll see you next time that is folks so take care out there and Blah, 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 blah. This is Myers. Signing off. Bye bye.